Hello, everyone. Um, I am Krish Vingatraman, Principal Solution Architect with Okta. I've been with the Okta a little over nine years now, and I've architected many solutions for lots of customers across the globe. I'm very excited today to talk about Journey with Netflix, um, well, which is one of my favorite brands in the media industry. Today, I'm joined with Satish from Netflix. Satish, please introduce yourself. Hi, everyone. I'm Satish, a senior software engineer at the Information Security Organization here at Netflix. I'm happy to stay, join the stage with Krish to share our journey with Dr. Workflows. Thank you, Satish. Um, Satish, uh, why don't you first give us a little introduction of Netflix starting from scale and how demanding and unique is your environment? Uh, sure. Uh, Netflix's investment in original content over the past decade has resulted in an astronomical growth of its workforce. Uh, this has resulted in hundreds of thousands of users. Uh, these users can be broadly classified into full-time employees and external partners. Um, the user personas are very diverse, starting from platform engineers, CDN engineers, DVD employees, Netflix Studio users, and um, if you take external user past, sorry, external partner users landscape, it's even more diverse with uh, studio users, ISP partner users, gaming partners, journalists, and vendors. Um, all these people help us deliver the exciting content you get to watch on our service. Uh, here we have an example of few business units and the personas with them. They help deliver Netflix. Uh, they help Netflix deliver story from pitch to play and have very unique onboarding needs. And as you see, the permutation and combinations of the personas and their unique onboarding needs make this a very big challenge for Netflix. Amazing. I can imagine, like you know how. Uh... Netflix would have been like, you know, if they want to like talk um, Stranger Things or something, how it will be like identity bec becomes a big part. So that was a great talking about personas of users and how demanding it can be, right? I can imagine that, um, for example, like, you know, uh, let us talk about complexity now, right? When we started Discovery with Netflix on their implementation prior to Okta, you can see we have like multiple personas of uh, users, right? As Satish said, and everyone had uh, their own like process of orchestration, no consistency and, and centralized process, right? So if you look at it on the right side, we have animation, show users. On the left side, they have like a uh, uh, workforce. So like these are all like so much like, you know, uh, different processes. Satish, why don't you just talk us a little bit on your day-to-day -day challenge with this architecture? Uh, sure. Uh, Netflix has uh, different identity stores, as you can see from the diagram here. And uh, to cater to their business needs, teams started tapping into disparate sources using custom solutions for managing the life cycle of the workforce. Uh, users needs to be provisioned into one or more of these identity stores. Uh, and the solutions we had in place were very fragmented, inconsistent, and complex to manage. Uh, debugging issues with onboarding and offboarding needed inspection of logs from multiple systems and was very cumbersome and uh, reactive process. Um, they were presenting problems with discoverability, auditability, and governance in general. And uh, let's not forget the enormous security risks. Uh, that we had to deal with deprovisioning and access revocation oversight. Uh, on top of it, uh, we also used to get like a lot of custom ad hoc requests for onboarding and offboarding, and this just made it a big, big mess. Uh, Netflix was also making a huge bet on mergers and acquisitions for gaming, and this problem was bound to actually get even more worse. Sir. Yep, I can imagine like how much mergers you guys uh, have uh, are going through. With this challenge, like we saw on the last slide, right? Uh, we quickly understood like there is a bigger opportunity to help Netflix to unify their identity lifecycle process across all their business units. So they were looking really like for a next generation of orchestration engine and a centralized platform to manage identities. That's what really this diagram is telling if you look at it. So we realized like, you know, that Okta UD and workflows can really serve as a centralized platform. So let us talk about a solution uh, next. So you can see here how Okta became their centralized identity orchestration layer. Our goal is to unify the identity lifecycle process across all their personas using Okta workflows, right? Uh, this includes both on-prems and also like cloud solutions. I will let Satish talk about like, you know, how we have achieved this whole thing. Satish, like, why don't you give us the uh, full full view of this? Sure. Uh, we added it an architecture where Okta access the unified centralized orchestrator of identity lifecycle management at Netflix. Workday served as our sole onboarding system, and uh, with Okta's excellent integration and real-time full sync capabilities with Workday, it was a big win for us. Okta's uh, universal directory ingested all of the identities from Workday, and Okta workflows became the centralized orchestration layer for uh, all the business logic for onboarding and offboarding requirements across 
uh, all, all the organizations. Uh, Octa workflows out of the box connectors and generic API connectors help us help us integrate with all the third party cloud solutions and on-prem solutions uh, quickly with ease. Uh, integration with on-prem solutions were made possible using Netflix Wally callbacks and a common gateway service called OctaBridge. With this architecture, we were able to consolidate and express all of our identity lifecycle processes in Octa workflows. That is great, Satish. Uh, so now let's talk about, let's tell us like, you know, uh, how simple to develop things using workflows, Octa workflows, and also walk us through the Netflix results as well. Uh, sure. Octa Workflows is, is very simple, intuitive, and uh, helps us really move fast with workflow development uh, in a drag and drop fashion. Uh, the ramp up time was pretty fast, and the out of box third party integrations were really, really slick. Uh, our custom homegrown solutions needed like developers to create and manage workflows. It used to take us a few weeks to develop, test, and deploy new, new workflows, and a lot of time was spent to debug and fish, fix any issues we encountered. Octa Workflows actually provided us with a zero code solution where uh, the need of the developer was eliminated and a security engineer can um, understand the business requirements and configure the workflows and move forward at a really great pace. It cut down our implementation, which was averaging around multiple weeks to few hours. And then this greatly improved our velocity and productivity. Uh, testing the workflows in the previous uh, world was also a big challenge and Octa Workflows made it very, very simple for us. Uh, overall, Octa workflows brought in great visibility and served as a centralized orchestration layer we badly needed uh, to cater to the scale of our uh, demanding business. And uh, to talk about some of the wins, we successfully managed to retire all of our legacy onboarding system and replace it with Octa workflows. Uh, this has been a big win for us and uh, we really got appreciated and uh, encouraged by a lot of our internal business users and teams. Uh, we also managed to roll out a unified onboarding offboarding experience for our distributed global workforce in a centralized fashion with Octa workflows, which was not even possible with the uh, previous setup. Uh, this has actually reduced our internal customer frustration and vastly improved our productivity. And um, Octa workflows also played a big, big part in our recent mergers and acquisitions that would have been very challenging in the world before. Uh, overall, we are very happy and we are looking forward to the new features that are going to be rolled out with the next version of Octa Workflows. And uh, I'm pretty sure that's going to make our lives uh, and digital lives even more better. Thank you. Thank you so much, Satish. It was really amazing, like, you know, how Netflix went through this journey. And uh, we hope, like, well, it also will help more and more, like, you know, when we roll out a lot of new product release. Thank you so much for your time today.